A lot of folks still cleaning up after floods hit parts of East Tennessee over the weekend. Yeah, Sevier County seems to have gotten the worst of it. Several roads are still closed due to heavy rain. Let's get to our Sam Luther joining us now. One family in particular seeing a lot of damage at their home. Yeah, guys, Seton Springs Road, it was one of the places county crews were out working today. The road still drivable, but for one of the families who lives alongside it, they'll have weeks of repairs, likely costing them thousands. I moved here from Miami because it was like hurricane after hurricane after hurricane, and I thought, wow, Tennessee is such a peaceful place. Nothing goes wrong here. Lydia Kordolevsky moved to Sevier County 11 years ago. Last night, when rain started to fall, she looked out her window to see her backyard underwater. Neighbors had similar realities. Oh, devastated. Everybody was calling each other, every neighbor. Are you okay? Is everything okay? Other phone calls. People would ask, did you see my stuff floating by? Found a lot of stuff today in the daytime. Debris from nearby finding its way into the pond behind Kordolevsky's house and a bridge that's seen people get married on it completely washed away by the storm. You know, I named the bridge after my dad who was a World War II survivor. So it was kind of like personal. So I need to get that bridge back up. They were able to recover the sign for the bridge. The family estimates it could cost thousands to rebuild what they lost. It's bad. It looks like something out of a movie that has some serious issues. <laughs> Water from the pond and creek nearby covering this entire backyard. Nobody at this home was hurt as people here work together looking to find items lost that may have drifted away. Glad that everybody's safe and we're in a good area. Neighbors helping neighbors. That's what's really important. People checking up on each other. Yeah, they tell me the part that really surprised them the most was how much damage this did just a short amount of time. Guys, they told me really only felt like 10 or 15 minutes when they were watching it from their window. They're waiting now to see if insurance will be able to cover any of those repairs, but they fear it likely won't. And more rain, more storms are on the way. Sam, thanks a lot.